hello beautiful people hello guys welcome back to our youtube channel the tm media and guys thank you for watching and supporting this youtube channel guys uh, greetings to you all our number one fans from saudi arabia our fans from uganda our fans are watching from the united states of america our fans who are watching from europe we are introducing to you this business segment and in this business segment we are going to be bringing you videos about business tips business ideas which kind of businesses you can do in uganda and we'll be giving you in details quotations of different kind of businesses if you have any business that you want to start in uganda and you want research you need a quotation you need to know how can you start up such kind of business please consider subscribing and comment in the comment section which kind of business you want and we shall i shall be doing a video on any business that you want to start up in uganda because i'll be doing a lot of research from people who are doing these kind of businesses and in today's video i'll go directly into the video in today's video guys i want to tell you or show you how to start your own beauty saloon on you know a, a minimum amount of at least four million ugandan shillings uh, right now i believe i'm talking to a person who is in uh, america a person especially a person who is in saudi arabia a girl a lady a woman who has a dream of working in a saloon who has a dream of starting up a saloon who has a dream of you know uh, being a makeup artist you know doing pedicure manicures women styling uh, you know styling uh, people on weddings styling you know maids so guys just get a pen and a paper and i take you through this video on how to start up your own beauty salute in uganda at only four million ugandan shillings for starters guys for you guys who are working abroad even if you're in uganda first we all know saloon business is very liable it is very relevant all over the world not only in uganda but i'm talking to people who are ugandans and you want to start up a saloon in uganda now guys for starters on the list that i'm going to give you on in this quotation i want to break up this four million ugandan shillings on how you can use it on actually starting up a unisex saloon which works on both men and women so if you're starting up a small saloon you will need just a room that is in the size of let's say 15 to 15 you know feet that room can be enough for you i'm going to tell you how for starters at least now i've started the quotation guys get a pen and a paper first first keep aside 800 ugandan shillings for rent just keep that money for rent keep 800 ugandan shillings for rent i hope guys you're writing the next item or the next thing you should keep in mind keep another 800,000 ugandan shillings for carpentry work minimum because i'm saying you're starting up small you don't want to go for expensive stuff but 800 should do it for carpentry stuff putting up the bin boxes on the wall and uh, and all that kind of carpentry work getting the the, the, the the you know the reception table on at a very cheap price you can even get it at a hundred thousand one fifty it depends where you get it but i'm on people who are who want to start, start small and make sh and make it you know to that big dream of you know owning a very successful and big big saloon those are two items i said rent eight hundred thousand uganda shillings carpentry again 800 uganda 800 uganda shillings add the third item again get a hundred eight hundred thousand shillings for the adjustable chairs or styling chairs keep 800 ugandan shillings for the adjustable or styling chairs that is the third item guys i hope you're writing now the next item you would get a dryer you can get a big dryer we have two types of dryers there is a, a stand dryer you know the, the old-fashioned ones with a stand now the new dryers that we have on the market we have the 
wall mounting dryer you'll see a photo passing by of a wall mounted dryer so a wall mounted dryer actually is very good because for starters even if right now it goes for minimum 500 uganda shillings 500 uganda shillings a new mount a wall mounted dryer you can get a wall mounted dryer anywhere in any shop that sells saloon equipment after the the hair dryer the big one that goes for 500,000 Uganda shillings we'll go to the next item you can get that is the wall mounted dryer that you've seen the next item you can get is a flat iron you can get it at around 120,000 Uganda shillings a flat iron at 120,000 Uganda shillings another item you can get a water heater at 120,000 Uganda shillings this is an average i'm giving you but you can even get it at as less as little as 80,000 you know a water heater you will need a water heater you will need a water storage tank for at least a minimum of 40 liters you know anything from downtown you can get it at around 40,000 Ugandan shillings 40,000 Ugandan shillings you can get a water storage tank the another item is a blow dryer the small one that you use to blow dry women hair after you know washing their hair you can get that at at least 80,000 Ugandan shillings ideas another item you can get towel and aprons when you go downtown you can get them at around 60,000 towels and aprons get yourself a wa machine that cuts men's hair which will go at least to at least 130000 uganda shillings a machine that cuts men's hair get yourself a sink seat a sink seat that is locally made you can you can get it at around 380000 ugandan shillings when we add transport and miscellaneous costs of at least 130,000 that comes to the amount of 4 million it comes to the amount of 4 million Ugandan shillings you have the equipments now the other equipments that I've not talked about you know the, the, those petty petty stuffs let's say the combs you know those small small things you used to make the corn rolls uh, I've not talked about the, the, the you know the the cosmetics part of it but still that can't cost you much because the saloon what makes a saloon are these equipments i've talked about the other things cannot cost you that much as long as you get these ones and remember these prices i've given you can be adjusted actually even a bit lower i've just given you an average price but there are different sites you can go and buy these products you know on a very cheap price instead of going for the new ones like there is Gigi Uganda Gigi Uganda has a lot of people who sell saloon equipments at a lower price those which are used but still that are in good condition but note when you're buying something for, from from Gigi from you know such platforms online make sure you first meet that person make sure you get that gadget whatever you're buying that is a wall dryer you see there whatever you're buying first test it and make sure that it is working before you pay in your money guys i hope you've got something in this video what i want is to you know you know to to give you that vibe to give you that you know you get that confidence that really things can happen in uganda you can do any business that you want for as long as you're committed and you have a passion of doing business in uganda and when you have a dream that you want to succeed in So a saloon business in Uganda is very profitable guys you can make a lot of money in it there are a lot of things that go around with the saloon business it can help you bring in other businesses let's say mobile money you can even bring in uh, you can put it, put aside a fridge you can be selling you know fruits juices water to the customers that come by to be worked on upon in your saloon so guys i want to briefly repeat the items i've told you in summary first rent 800 uganda shillings 800 000 uganda shillings that is rent 
carpentry, 800,000 Uganda shillings, adjustable chair, dryer for 500,000 Uganda shillings, adjustable chair for 800,000 Uganda shillings, plastic chair for 30,000 Uganda shillings, a flat iron of 120,000 Uganda shillings, a water heater of 120,000 Uganda shillings, a storage water tank of 40,000 Uganda shillings, a blow dryer that goes up to 80,000 Uganda shillings, towels and aprons, 60,000 Uganda shillings, machine for men, cutting men's hair, for 130,000 Uganda shillings, 130,000 Uganda shillings, a sink with a seat, which can go up to 380,000 Uganda shillings, transport and miscellaneous, 130, 130,000 Uganda shillings, 130,000 Uganda shillings. So, guys, I hope you've got something in this message. And really, if you need more of this video, guys, just like, share this video, comment in the comment section which business idea you have but you want to research you want to research and you want to start such a business so guys i want to thank you so much for keeping locked into this youtube account youtube channel the tm media and tech guys we thank you for supporting us i hope you've got something from this video of how to start your own beauty saloon in uganda i hope you've noted down at least i've given you a hint or a picture of what is needed of what is required to start up a saloon business a small saloon minimum four million and that is a unisex let's say it's just a, you know a women's saloon it will even the, the that amount the budget will even go low so guys thank you so much for listening to me thank you for supporting this youtube channel guys i pray so that god bless you in whatever you do so that you'll be successful Keep yourself locked up into the tier media. More, more content is coming in. We love you all. Stay locked into tier media. We love you guys. May God bless you. Bye.